really excited that the opening of the regional rail link is nearly here. It's only a few short weeks away and an important part of uh, getting ready for the opening of the services from the 21st of June is of course to release the new timetable and what a fantastic new timetable it is with a significant boost to services, particularly uh, to the communities in the, in the western suburbs and to Geelong. Geelong in particular is the beneficiary of an additional 200 weekday services. That's a massive boost for the communities of Geelong and the western suburbs who are along that line. Also too, there'll be uh, time and reliability improvements for the Ballarat and the Bendigo corridors as well. And really, this shows that the Regional Rail Link project is more than just a wonderful infrastructure project and a wonderful infrastructure project it is when you consider that it's the uh, most uh, significant investment in new uh, rail lines in uh, Victoria in around 80 years. Uh, with uh, 90 kilometres of new track, two new stations. What it also is, is it realises the dream for regional communities in the Ballarat, Bendigo and Geelong corridors, that we are able to see the train lines in those corridors separated from the metropolitan services. It means that services will be more reliable. They won't get caught up within the metropolitan system, providing a more reliable uh, service, opportunity to provide significant additional services. And we should focus for a moment on the bus services that this, uh, that this opening uh, and the release of the new timetable details, because there's significant effort has gone into coordinating uh, bus timetables, again, uh, particularly in Geelong and for the, around the new stations at Wyndham Vale at Tarnie. There's been a massive boost to bus services and again importantly they're going to be coordinated with the train timetable to make it easier for people to get around the city and get around the state. Authorised by Victorian Government, One Treasury Place, Melbourne.